Hey, Bubby. Hi, everybody. We're in Aim Prat. Bubby and uh, Sophia are uh, hanging out in the, the dry part, and everybody else is down here. We're gonna go. We're gonna go downstairs and see them all. Talk about Marcus. Yeah, exactly. I figure the walk over there will be a good opportunity to talk about uh, what Malcolm pointed out to us. Today is uh, Erev uh, Tisha B'Av. Tonight is Shabbat, so Tisha B'Av it will be on Sunday. And uh, Ain Prat is an area called Ataot, which apparently is um, where Yirmiyahu actually lived. And it was a city full of Kohanim, um, not too far from Yerushalayim, and supposedly from one of these mountains you can actually see Yerushalayim. And uh, <coughs> this is where <coughs> historically Kohanim once lived. And now, I'm sure they had a stream there then Not also. The Whoa, there are fish. Not you. Oh, careful, you. careful, careful. Everybody say hello, they were making a video. Is it? Oh, it's the most disgusting thing ever. Donnie, what do you have to say about Ain Prat? Get, get your feet all wet and cool off. You know, Ima. Thanks for the shear, I just gave a recap for the video. Now, it's the nine days, so on one hand, we're going to learn all about Ain Prat and, and how important it was to Yirmiyahu as he prophesied. On the other hand, we can't really go swimming. But, Hashem wouldn't want us to die in the heat here, so we can, uh, we can cool off our feet as we walk through the stream. Right? Okay, maybe the fish will nibble your toes. The next part of the Ain Prat Ain part. Yonit, you know what you call this in English? A creek walk. Because you're walking through a creek. This is a creek, uh, like a uh, Mayan is a kind of creek. So it looks like we're in the middle of beautiful nature, desert mountains. We're here because of the water source, so if you look. All the way out there, you see lots of mountain, mountain, uh, dry area of the desert. And then all of a sudden, you have this little oasis palm trees and plush green. And then, just to remind you that you're still in civilization, you see a car smack in the middle of the scenery. So, we carry on in our creek walk. Donnie is leading the way, followed by Yonit, then Abba. Mayan was behind me, but it looks like she went back to the part that had a little more water to cool off with. And some people climb up the mountains over there. How far does this creek walk go? Are we going to go through the bushes too? No, I don't think it's a good idea. This is where the creek walk ends, babes. Yeah, we can walk on the side over here and see and see if there's another part afterwards. Come. Come over here. I don't want you to get poison ivy or anything like this. It is poison. There, there might be a lot of bugs over there. But they don't have zoos. Oh, here comes Mayan. Hi, Mayan. 